Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy, the Shiesty Reefer. Back with another one. <clears throat> Coming to you with a different vlog type. Uh, I just want y'all to see the Shiesty Reefer real quick. You know what I'm saying? What's going on? But uh, yeah, man, got some nice updates on the tank. <clears throat> just want to give y'all a real quick rundown on the whole 45 gallon tank build. So as y'all can see, man, it looks pretty decent man i ain't gonna cap with y'all yo like i'm very proud of where i'm at at this stage you know what i'm saying in my <clears throat> reefing journey um so let's go ahead and run down what i have going on from top to bottom and then we can kind of get into the livestock uh and stuff like that, you feel me? So, from the top down, we got this LED light. Still ain't gonna hold you. Don't even know what brand it is, but it's doing its job, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't mad. You already know I got this joint off Facebook Marketplace, so it is what it is. <clears throat> right now, we running some, uh, you know what I'm saying? Some like filter floss type stuff. Uh, I got a bag of Kimmy Pure in there. I got some like bio cubes in there. And then I got some like macro algae. It's probably not really doing nothing, but it's I, I actually, I think it is doing something. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, so that's what we got in the first caddy. <clears throat> nothing in the second caddy, but I am thinking of actually putting some like bio, you know what I'm saying? Like bio blocks in there just so we can have some, you know what I'm saying, some more, uh, you know what I'm saying, rocks, so good bacteria can be on it and shit, you feel me? Uh, and there we got uh, two heaters, return pump, I think it's the J-Bow, and then over here we have this uh, mag tool protein skimmer. I'm just now kind of getting it dialed in, but I like it, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Over here we have, I think it's that Coral Life um, UV sterilizer. I think it's a nine watt. So underneath what we have is, I have a 10 gallon reservoir, you know what I'm saying? It's just like a 10 gallon fish tank for my <clears throat> ATO, which, the crazy thing is the, this particular tank and the way that the lid is, I I don't even really get that much evaporation, you know. Now I just started the protein skimmer, so the evaporation is a little bit more, but it's not like it's not even really like that. Putting yeah. together my you know mad scientist type of deal. But uh as y'all can see got me a i definitely want to get a real controller like an apex or something like that but for now i found this joint on amazon yo it's one of them surge protectors that's that has the individual uh blocks that you can turn you know what i'm saying you can turn each one of them off so this definitely helps uh in the aquarium you know what i'm saying hobby um I got a doser, which I'm not using yet. As y'all can see, I got my ink bird. And that's my uh, return pump. We are also dosing. Um, uh, I'm dosing kelp. I'm dosing kelp. I'm doing like, probably like 20 mils a day right now. And then, I'm doing no pox and I am doing uh, the Red Sea AV Plus. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I'm only doing like one meal a day of that just because I ain't really got a lot of coral in here. So I ain't trying to overdo it. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to be really one of them dudes that's just gonna be like, like uh, I'ma let the coral tell me what's going on with the tank. You feel me? Now, as far as the livestock in the tank, um, 
as y'all can see, y'all can see I got uh, some tomato clowns in the back. We do have a cleaning shrimp. Yo, he's mad cool. I fucks with my guy. Yo, he chill. He be, he be all around the tank. Even that action. We do have some green star polyp. I know everybody like, oh man, that's like, I wanted to get some of this just so I can have a little bit of confidence in growing some coral because they said this is one of the easiest corals to grow. And so far since I've been in the, my, you know what I'm saying, reefing journey, it's been growing. I can see it growing. Um, right here, we got a nice little blast though. It ain't nothing crazy. Um, so, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's straight. Uh, as y'all can see, my boy back there, I got a little yellow watchman goby back there. He chilling. He was a resident up under this rock. But then somebody else came in and, yo, and took his little crib. So now he be back this way. But he be cooling, yo. He be all around the tank, too. But that's his little cave. I am thinking about pairing him up, trying to get a pistol shrimp. You know what I'm saying? Now, I actually do have, it's another, I got a, a sand sifting goby. Now, here is that sand sifting goby that I was telling you about that he pretty much is doing whatever the hell he wants in here. And he in that little cave in there, y'all. He be, Y'all can see, look how look how he didn't did. Like, he be mad disrespectful, y'all. As y'all can see, I got some turbo snails. That is, that is the female. The female, uh, tomato clown. Now, I'm telling y'all, yo, she be turned up, for real. She really do, yo. Like, as soon as I be trying to, like, put my hand in the tank, to try to do some cleaning or something like that, yo. She be on me, yo. She be biting me and everything. So y'all can see right here, we got me a little pink stylo. All of extensions is nice on that joint right now, you feel me? Like I said, I'm just gonna be one of them dudes that's like, yo, like I'm gonna let the, let the coral let me know what's going on. Yeah, that's a little male tomato clown. Now I do got some new stuff coming, yo. I'm telling y'all, keep your eye out, yo. For real. But yeah, man, we got some got some crab, uh, some little hermit crabs in there. But I do got some new stuff coming in, yo. Like, yo. Now I was at my LFS show and I'm like, yo, I need to get, you know what I'm saying, some some motion in here. You feel me? I grabbed this one for $10, and it's doing the job, yo. Now, it ain't no crazy, yo, like, definitely I want to get some Ecotech type shit, you feel me? But for now, for $10, yeah, we got some motion. Y'all can see, you know what I'm saying? She moving stuff around. Now, I just got these right here, y'all. Now, this is from Innovative Marine, the Spin Stream. Now you can just drop, grab the joint and swap them out with your, you know, normal return nozzles. And this joint just kind of like, it's got some blades in them joints or whatever. And it just spins the, you know what I'm saying, shit around. So that's cool. So, yo, I'm telling y'all, keep your eye out for this, for that rock. I'm telling y'all. And then it means on the way, yo, it's gonna be crazy. But y'all, let me know what y'all think of the tank. Let me know what y'all think of the tank, yo. It's coming along, I think so.